I, I usually find with peasant armies they just kind of stay there. Um, we'll get rid of you actually. And uh, you. You three though can go to here. Oh wait, he's broken up an army. I've actually never seen peasants do that. <laughs> Usually they always don't bother. They have nice little uh, unit sprites actually. They look kind of nice. Oh wait, he's now going to Tartu, 12th of December. You'll escape, but you will not. I'll put you two together and you go here. Okay, 1st of December. It takes a long time to walk around here. Now they're all going to there. Top of December 13th. Um, hmm. Okay. Interesting. How about we change the path then? Everyone go here. You'll go 12th of December. Okay, they won't be able to escape. So the question is, do I send everyone there? They have low morale as well. Do you want us to get rid of you? Let's get rid of them. We can still defeat them even without them. 27th of December. 12th of December. Get rid of them. There's only 12 men. He's probably getting very confused. Like, where are all his soldiers going? His soldiers just keep disappearing. How do we stop them? Um, yeah, just get him to do it. Go on, Smith. Make us proud. Okay, 25th of December, 15th of December. Not sure why he's going there. Him, if he does go there, I'll just attack him. Nope, he's, he's... As soon as I said that, it's like the computer just heard me. It's like the computer actually heard me say it. Uh, I'm going to get everyone together. So we can try and lose as little men as possible. God damn little tribal thing. Like I said though before, uh, the whole prestige thing is so important. Having that opportunity just to be able to raise 2,500 men is probably a lifesaver for you. Send for February. Might as well wait. When we go to battle, my vassals will probably attack me, I bet. So we're going to planes. God damn peasants. He shouldn't be able to escape. He was able to, but he's going across the sea. Jesus Christ. Come on. We're going to have to go across, aren't we? There's not much I can do about this. I would rather not, but, you know, he's gone there now. There's not much we can do. We can't take any lands. I can probably let him escape. How about if I stop? No, he stops. Yeah, we're going to have to do it. This is the only way. I'll lose a lot of men, which means my vassal will probably rebel. But, you know, that's the price we pay. That's the price. My bloody wife stopped getting pregnant. What is wrong with you? Have you ever heard of contraception? No? No? Okay. Me neither, actually. I've never heard of contraception. Sweden, again, is getting big. They've literally just took back all they lost. Which is slightly worrying, because they'll probably come after me next. Though they're actually after Pomerania. They probably have their eye on this place, though. They probably have their eye on me. Okay, so the walls are over again. Now, what to do with my prisoner? Spanish you. Goodbye. Have fun in Sweden. I just, it just, it had the crown thing, so I'm assuming he went to Sweden. So that's why I said have fun in Sweden. Subjugation of Norway. Okay. I was make sure no one's taken Rana. We just want that place. Goddamn dangerous factions. Damn them all. Can I give you something? Did someone die? No one's died. Okay, I'm going to increase this place. So if we ever do uh, do something, we can have that. I'm also going to build something with prestige, probably, because I feel like I've been not doing that, because I've been trying to get my prestige up all the time. 
It's important that we do that. Uh, how's Ruthenia doing? Yeah, he can get a lot of men. 3,000, Jesus. We do need to be careful of him. He's going to be a thorn on our side. Hopefully our two kingdoms can live in peace. Our two great tribal kingdoms. What is your family name? Uh, Radimich. Okay. Okay, Radimich. He has two sons. Just like me. We might face the same similar problem. Uh, Serbia is still okay. The Umeads. Everyone else is just the same. No one else ever seems to be doing much. Except Sweden. Damn you, Sweden. Damn you. Can I hold like a festival? Oh. Um, okay. Let's come to decrease the level of tribal organization. Uh, high tribal organization. Do you know what? Let's just do it. Because it makes people like me. I feel like we've just been having that. And that was even the same one, was it? It was for the Poland. Yeah. Okay. Fine. Yep, we still have absolute tribal organization. And everyone's happy. Great. There we go. This is how a realm should be. So, okay, so we got our realm kind of sorted at the moment. Um, Vassal Hamzit's warning. I'm sure someone would declare war on this guy. Yep. Defender against... Oh, he's helping fight them. Okay. But they're kind of allies. Uh, this guy. Hmm. I could declare war against these smalls, like I said, but it just wouldn't help me because we'll just gain demands. I'll have to give it to someone else and he won't give me any men. It won't actually make me more powerful. The only way we gain stuff is actually for my own stuff. Really? So, there's hardly any point. So really, I just want those damn holy sites. Come on. Get this. Come on. You've got to do it. Let's check out Mary as well. So he's at war with a few people. This might be just the best time to try it. Yeah, do you know what? We might as well. Same dynasty. Moron. Okay, he has this land. Ah, not to jur. He is just this. Okay. He's basically lost everything but this place. So I can't imagine he's that powerful. Yeah. 820 men. And he's got lots of wars to deal with right now. He's at war with... Subjugation of Rus, that one's almost done. Uh, subjugation of Bulgaria, that's just started. The only reason I don't want to attack him is just because of this guy. I just worry that maybe... I, I know we're the same religion and stuff, but he might have a secret claim I don't know about. Then again, he's gone down to 1,700. Just do it. Let's just take Novgorod. I want Novgorod. I just want it, and we're one step closer. Let's do it. I just feel like we'll be one step closer to actually that goal. That's so far off goal. That at the start was pretty far off, but we're actually getting quite close to it now. We're so close. How many men defend this? Okay, about 700 men. So there's no point attacking until we have about 700 men. So we'll wait until they appear. Damn, a son. Stanislav. Hmm, that might be a problem there. Yep, titles in succession. We'll lose... We'll lose the High Chieftain of Drago Vichia? What? Why would I lose that one? Why would I keep... Oh. Why would I keep Lesser Poland? I guess Lesser Poland's actually the most powerful. Okay, actually that makes sense, to be honest. That does probably make sense. Would we use would we lose Plotsk? Pinsk. Yeah, we'd lose Pinsk. I don't want to lose Pinsk. God damn it. Hmm. Actually our more powerful ones in Krakow. Huh, actually Krakow is probably our best province. Uh let's go Krakow. This was the old capital of the Polish. Okay, it's actually done quite well. They have one of each of these. Do you know what? Maybe I should make this my capital. Uh, 599, garrison size 700. So the levy is 599, 700. Oh. Hmm. 
Pinsk is pretty good though. 1.5 gold. Lots more gold here though. And we still have a new administration. Do you know what? I'm gonna make, once this is gone, we're gonna make this my capital. It expires 835. So when that goes, I'm actually gonna make Krakow my capital. And we're gonna try and turn all our people into Ilmania. Now known as the fat. So let's check the culture thing again. Who's actually most of our culture? Ilmanian is actually hardly any of our culture. Uh, but Estonian, Magillian, Polish is actually the most. Maybe I should move here to Krakow, convert to Polish, and convert everyone to Polish. Because most of our land is Polish, sadly. Um, I, I don't mean sadly because I don't want to be Polish, but because we didn't start as Polish, I kind of feel like, eh. We'll see. It probably would make everything a lot better, or a lot easier, having it Polish and converting the rest of Polish, rather than trying to convert it to Ilmanian, because that seems kind of silly. Okay. But by taking this, we're probably going to be stopping Sweden from being able to enter Europe, which might make him upset. Let's have a look here. How many men can you call upon? 4,000 when it gets to its highest level. That is pretty crazy. That is pretty good. I'm going to increase time. I, I know that's going to be reckless of me, but I feel like we'll be fine. I feel like he has so many other wars right now that he's not probably focused on us. 700 men. We'll wait for these guys to join this one. I will move this one to also take a place. Ah, yes. My liege, my working manner seems to have come to fruition. My bribing, cajoling, exhorting, and threatening. We now have a claim. 46 gold. Uh, lose 150 prestige. Okay, perfect. Use it. So we just cost us all our gold, but we now have a claim on the runner. Perfect. So that means we might be able to save the faith. If only the morale authority would go up. Um, improve relations, I think, would be next. So, vassals. Now, Poland. Uh, Cilicia. Let's try uh, Cilicia. Just because I think Poland's always going to hate me. There we go. But yes, I can't believe we finally got that claim. We're one step away. Well, two steps. We just need to do these two things. And then the third step is actually reforming the faith, which in itself is quite hard. Now, I'm not even I'm not even concentrating on how we will uh, reform the faith. I'm just concentrating on the fact that, you know, we need to take this places. Uh, I need gold. And there's no way for me to get gold. Hmm. Okay, fine. We'll leave it for now. Ah. Moron is just grown. Luckily, we're not fighting him. Damn. So he went from having basically hardly anything to now having this place. Are you bloody kidding me? Okay, I need to keep an eye on this. Keep an eye on our money. We keep losing it and then we gain it. Okay. More arm has just been called into the war. Okay, who's he called in then? A fat high chief of Moram and all that stuff. Ugra. Okay, this is where he might have a problem now. Wow, he just... There must have been some sort of succession war, but luckily he doesn't have many men. So even with the men we have now, we should still actually have enough to be able to win. I better keep an eye on. Oh yes, Sweden looks like it split apart. Perfect. Okay, that's good. Oh my god, Finland! We have the Kingdom of Finland. Oh, the Kingdom of Finland. I love seeing that. I don't know why. I guess it's because Finland's you know, an actual country that's around now. It's kind of nice to see it and you hardly ever see it. Oh, that's kind of cool. He's kind of weak at the moment though, I guess. Yeah, because he only has one province of that. So he's going to face some problems, I think. Uh, but, hmm. That's kind of another kingdom. 
The tribals are really starting to make kingdoms, aren't they? We need to be more careful. Just need to reform the faith. Come on, how, how do we actually do that, actually? I want to check. So, three places. We need at least 750 piety. We're so close to that. And the moral authority. Yes, okay, we're actually really close. We almost have enough piety. We just need the moral, moral authority to be higher. Come on, guys. Okay, he's taken that. We're not going to get much war score, I think, because he has so many allies. I might need to go to his capital, which has already been taken. Hmm. Don't like that. That's mean. That's ours. We'll see. Maybe he loses that one, and then we can send men over there as well, and then take it off them again. Okay, 700 here. Uh... I'm going to send you there, and we're going to take this 2,000, and you're going to head up this way. Uh, we have a revolt there. We'll just head through. Don't mind us. We're just passing through. Uh, let's be merciful. She's just a nice woman. Um, we could ransom her. 26 gold. Sounds good to me. We do need the gold right now. Thank you very much. Pleasure doing business, good sir. Ransom one of these. 10 gold. Come on. 26 gold. That's more like it. Um, she's an idiot as well. Perfect. Let's click on in then. So that's his daughter. Okay. So who's the other daughter then? I don't know. Okay. I assume the other one was his daughter actually. Okay, we've almost gotten a percentage. So we send these across. We're going to have to be careful. Don't want to get surprised. The 3rd of November. Okay, yep. We're fine. 4th of December. Okay, no one's appearing. Okay, we have a large army there. So we're not going to head there. So Mary's trying to take that back. Hmm. He's trying to take this back. So that's his joint army of allies. So if I go here and try to take that back. Do you know what? Let's stay here. We'll go up this way. And we'll take this because he's their ally. That'll give us some more points. Because we're doing quite well. 68%. Marom's facing its own problems. Factions. Yep, no problems with factions right now. Sweet. What the? What the hell is this? There's a very tiny revolt. 